Okay, it's evening now. I'm here during live stream. I'm really excited. Big thing, absolutely. Test is coming, not only for PC, but also on PlayStation 5 and Xbox. So let's check details. Before we start, let me just say, subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more of Throne and Liberty videos in the future. First question here. This is official website of Throne and Liberty, global version of the game. We have here a few very interesting questions. And you will see one of the biggest news here is regarding regions, regarding, uh, regarding consoles. We already know that from before. But regarding regions, developers of the game and publisher, they have included not only North America, South America, Europe and Japan, but also Australia and New Zealand. Really amazing. Let's check first information here. When, when is the confidential closed beta test? The confidential closed beta test will start on April 10 and continue throughout April 17 in North America, Europe, South America, Asia Pacific, Japan, Australia, New Zealand, on PC, Steam, and on PlayStation 5 and Xbox. Sign up for a chance to play in confidential closed beta test. So, NDA will be up, which is kind of be a little bit surprising. I would say a little bit surprising, but then again, nothing wrong with that. I'm saying it's surprising because we are already playing, we are already playing Throne Liberty in Korea since December 7, 2023. So more than four months, right? So why NDA? Probably there are some changes which uh, publisher of this game, Amazon Games and developers, NCSoft, they want to keep hidden for now. They did change the game. They needed uh, to, uh, to make some kind of adjustments, absolutely. So for now, NDA will be up regarding this test, right? It is confidential closed beta test. Now, will we see or not some kind of open beta, maybe before release of the game? Maybe even not. Because we might go from this closed beta test directly into release of the game, maybe even during May. There is no need for any kind of open beta, honestly here, right? They can go directly for release of the game very soon, maybe in May, June, who knows? July, that would be probably a little bit too far. We'll talk about that a little bit later. And let's check another question here. What platforms will the confidential closed beta test be available on? So we've already seen that. Uh, the confidential closed beta test, a cross-play, cross-play, cross-platform MMORPG. Yes, we already knew that from before, right? Regarding cross-play, it's supported. So it will be available on PC, Steam, PlayStation 5, and Xbox Series. Uh, so basically, uh, regarding this uh, technical test, right? It's very important to say that I think that one of the main reasons of this uh, closed beta test will be to test a different kind of technical difficulties which uh, this game might have also cross play maybe massive siege that would be interesting to see regarding game itself you know game is ready to be released game is ready to be released this is not like game was not released over there in korea four months ago regarding in-game features regarding game itself it's ready however this test they will also check this cross play function how it's working right uh, what regions will confidential closed beta test be available in? Absolutely amazing news here, right? That beside North American, European, South American, and Asia Pacific, Japan, we already knew that from before, Australia and New Zealand is included. That is it for now regarding other regions. Probably, I don't think that you will see any kind of expansion, but you never know, right? There is still a huge part of the globe our beautiful planet Earth, which is not covered with this release. However, this already here, North America, South America, Europe, Japan, Australia, and New Zealand, that is a lot. I know there, are, there will be some countries missing. However, you have VPN. Maybe even there won't be any IP block on Steam, right? Use VPN uh, or something after, glo after global release if your country will not be on officially supported countries list. We don't have that list for now. When I see list of the countries which are officially supported, like actual countries, not continents, I will let you know about that. For now, this is looking very good. What languages will the confidential closed beta test be available in? We have here English, Spanish, Spain and Latin America, French, German, Brazilian, Portuguese and Japanese on screen text. Game will have English, Japanese, and Korean voiceover. Oh, this is interesting. They will keep Korean voiceover. I mean, why not? Because to be honest here, right, 
over there we are currently playing on servers in Korea. Check my live streams on Twitch. I am live streaming every evening about 6 p.m. Central European time. Every evening, mandatory. I'm playing Throne and Liberty from December 7, 2023. Every day. I didn't miss even one day. Check my live streams on Twitch if you have any kind of questions regarding the game and also to be updated regarding what is currently happening with Throne and Liberty, Korean version of the game and also regarding global release. Let's check next question here. How will I know if I'm selected to participate in the confidential closed beta test? This is an interesting question. Players selected to participate in the confidential closed beta test will receive a welcome email from the Throne and Liberty team with instructions on how to gain access to the build. Uh, probably via Steam, if you have applied to play on PC. However, if you have applied to play on PlayStation 5 or Xbox, there will be other ways how to access the game. Instructions will follow. Uh, for more details, read the confidential closed beta test announcement. Will any progress, oh, this is important question, will any progress I make during the confidential closed beta test carry over to the live game? I assume no. And the answer is no. Of course, I mean, that would be really strange, right? That your progress from closed beta test would carry over to official release of the game. No, of course not. Any progress made during the confidential closed beta test will not carry over to the live game. So boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, everything is here looking kind of normal, like I would say. I have expect to see open beta, honestly here, not closed beta. And I didn't expect NDA. Nevertheless, it's fine. This is a huge step forward into the direction of release of the game. Now we can only wonder when. When the release of the game, right? And uh, probably May. May or June, right? It would be logical and very good move from Amazon Games. If they'll wait too long after June, it's not a good situation. There are many new upcoming, not only MMORPGs, many other releases competition is coming after june june july and then second half of the year you can see on my youtube channel you can see uh, clearly from other gaming news videos there are many new upcoming titles competition is coming so may or june would be perfect window opportunity for release of tl globally and this here in front of us this evening what you can see this closed beta test announcement is one huge step forward into that direction, right? So, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, I wanted to share with you uh, details regarding closed beta test. Uh, I'll put a link in the description, actually in the comments below my video, where you can apply for this closed beta test on uh, any platform you want, PlayStation 5, Xbox, or maybe on uh, PC. And uh, what to say except uh, stay hyped, stay positive. Uh, good news, finally, from Amazon Games for this evening. Thank you very much, Amazon Games. It's It's been time. Come on, seriously, right? So big thank you to Amazon Games and to NC Soft, right? For uh, finally making this step forward into direction of global release of the game. Thank you for watching the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Twitch to see more of Throne and Liberty videos in the future. I'm live streaming every evening about 6 p.m. Central European time, so join me to see some gameplay and to find out what is happening in MMORPG and PC gaming world. See you soon.